I like just the adrenaline rush. You like feel it. It's you feel it in your body. The speeds. Like how close you are, you can touch the car next to you if you really wanted to. Reach out the window and touch them, you're so close. Some of the other kids that we're racing with this week kind of lose their heads a little bit. I think you've seen it. There's a lot of young kids coming up through the ranks these days, and um, a, lot of them handle those, a lot of them handle themselves pretty well, and, and Derek's definitely one of the better ones. He's 14, but he has experienced a lot of different tracks and a lot of different styles of racing. Uh, they're all pretty nice to me. There's a bunch of other people like Harrison Burton that are the same age as me, and we all respect each other, and then we get the respect back. My dad got me into it when I went to all of his races, and I started racing go-karts, then I went to bandoleros, then trucks, now into race cars. Me and my dad are down here a lot at night. This is my seat. It's perfectly fit just for me, so no one else can really get in it unless if they're smaller. The pedals and everything are the same. The belts, once you're strapped in, you, you're not going to be able to move a lot. Yeah, it's pretty fun watching him. I used to go to his go-kart races. Um, a lot of the kids at school don't understand. Uh, actually, I don't really talk at school about racing a lot. Uh, he's a nice kid. Everyone thinks that you're going so fast. They're like, oh, how can you do that? Well, really when you're that close to the other cars, it's just like driving on the highway. You, can, you can't really tell that you're going 100 miles an hour. The biggest goal would be to make it to NASCAR, but First, we've got to focus on everything that's down here, like the super late models, and win all the stuff that we can in that.